5 best phone tracking applications or services through which you could find or trace a lost or stolen mobile phone includes an application or two that could help you to track a phone using its IMA number. So I would urge you to watch my video till the end because this is going to be super effective for you and these services may just help you find your phone. Hello my friend, my name is Kenneth Brown. How are we doing today? I hope fantastic. Well, if you're not, because of the fact that you've misplaced your phone, I'm very sorry. Let's make this simple, quick and easy. First phone tracking application that I would be introducing you to, which you may just know is known as Find My Device. This is an application by Google. So if you have misplaced your phone or your Android device, you could get onto a laptop, get onto google.com, just type in Find My Device and do a search. Click on the first suggestion. Once you do that, you are going to get an option to log in to this application using the same email address that was on your lost or stolen phone. Just do that and you are going to see the last location of your phone. So once you see that on maps out here, you could probably get back to that location to search for your phone. If you get it, well and good. If you do not, you could try and play sound. Maybe it was in silent mode. You could click on this option. Your phone will ring for five minutes, even if it is set to silent silent mode when it was misplaced. If you want to secure your device or lock it, you could check this option and your phone is going to get locked out of your Google account. But if you do not find your phone still, if you want to maybe safeguard your data, if your phone is still connected to the internet, you could check this option or click on this option to ensure that whatever data is synced to your Google account, which was on that phone is deleted so that Nobody else tries to at least misuse your data. So Find My Device works basically for Android devices. So if you find your phone using this service, fantastic. If you have not, just keep watching my video till the end. This, the second application or service that's gonna help you track a loss of stolen phone is Find My iPhone. If you have an Apple iPhone or an Apple device, this service helps you to track your phone even if it is switched off. This is a unique service that Apple has introduced. So get hold of a laptop or a smartphone nearby. Just put in Find My iPhone, click on the first option for Find My and you are going to be prompted to log in with your iCloud ID. So click on find your stuff on iCloud.com, get directed to this page, sign in using your iCloud credentials and you could see the last location for your Apple device on Maps or you may just be able to see the current location of your phone. Now find my device for Android devices and find my iPhone for Apple devices are two services that totally depend on the internet connection. So your phones have to be connected to the internet. The third application or the third service that you could try and utilize to find a lost or stolen phone of yours is by using the company services itself. So for instance, if you have a Samsung smartphone, you may just have this service uh, turned on Samsung smart things. Okay, so this is an application that could help you to trace a Samsung device which was misplaced. So in order for you to avail the service, you would have needed to switch on the service beforehand before it actually got lost so you never know you may have done that in the past so you could just give it a try okay so you could get onto samsung.com forward slash in forward slash apps smart things hyphen find forward slash and uh, you are going to be directed to this page this is the url okay you could just pause this video and uh, you could just copy this url onto your browser's address bar okay and get onto this page directly once you are here you could just uh, scroll down so this is how you should have set it up. You need to get to settings and then you click on your account out here. After that, you need to click on find my mobile. Then you need to go ahead and uh, check box this, allow this phone to be found. And once this is green, your phone is going to be traceable by this application. So when you misplace, for instance, your Samsung device, so you call up the customer support and uh, you speak to them. These guys are going to help you to trace your or you could get onto this page and go ahead and click on this get started you're going to be directed to this uh, specific page on which you have to put in your details log in and then you could trace your phone on maps itself you could see the current location of your phone or the last location of your phone apart from samsung these type of services is also available with motorola or huawei and other brands 
The fourth application or service that you could utilize to track a lost or stolen phone is by using anti-theft applications. Yes, anti-theft applications could actually help you to not only protect your phone from theft, but also help you to trace your phone even after it is misplaced or stolen. Yes, they do have this kind of a service. For instance, Cerebrus. This is an anti-theft app that could help you protect your data and also help you trace your device on maps if it is misplaced or stolen. Of course, these type of anti-theft apps come with a price. So if you are subscribed or signed up with these guys from before, you could utilize their services to track your lost or stolen phone. You could also go ahead and use Where's My Droid, a very useful anti-theft application providing you with the same service. Or apart from that, we also have Prey. Prey also allows you to keep track of your laptop. So if you by chance misplace your laptop, this could help you to trace or get your laptop back. You may just find other genuine anti-theft applications. Do your own research, get one for yourself so that when your phone is misplaced, you could use their services to try and get your phone back. The fifth application or service to track a lost or stolen mobile phone is by using a service from a specific department in your country that uh, helps you to track a phone using its IMEI number. Yes, we have that in India. I'm sure you may just have it in your country too. So you need to do your own research. For instance, in India, we have a department known as CEIR. This is uh, under the Department of uh, Telecommunications. These guys actually track a lost or stolen phone using its IMA number, whether it is switched off or whatever it is. Okay, so if you are in India, if you have a mobile phone that was purchased in India that has an IMA number for uh, Indian geo location then you could get on to this website ceir.gov.in and if you get onto the home page you could see that these guys have blocked over 1 million phones and have recovered over 700,000 phones so you could well imagine the usefulness of this specific department so if you want to ensure that your phone is tracked using its IMA number get onto the website just click on CEIR services you get a drop down menu like this click on block stolen or lost mobile phone get onto this page fill up this form now while you're filling up this form you would need two very important things number one a copy of an fir that you may have put in with the local police station get that scan it and upload that out here and you would need a working phone number so that you could receive an otp and a request id fill up the form submit it and chances are that you get your phone back and once this form is submitted, your IMAI number is totally blocked. So that's a very important thing because if anybody else finds your phone and has no intention of uh, giving it back to you, they may just want to utilize your phone for illegal services. All right. So in order for you not to get pulled up in the future for any kind of a misuse of your mobile phone, it is very important for you to block the IMA number. So this service not only tracks your phone, which was misplaced using its IMA number, but also helps you to block your IMA number or totally block your phone. So within a couple of days, if your phone is found, you're going to get notified about it. You have to come back to this website and request unblocking of your IMA number again so that you can use the phone. So you could get back to the website, click on CER services, click on unblock found mobile. Once you're here, put in the request ID, put in your phone number, give her a reason for unblocking, maybe you got it back. Uh, solve the capture, put in your mobile phone, get an OTP, and within a couple of hours, a few days, your phone is gonna be unblocked. Now, apart from these type of services, you could also go ahead and use Bluetooth trackers. So how it works is very simple. When you get a Bluetooth tracker, you attach it to your keychain, or if you have a card type of a tracker, you keep it in your wallet. If you leave your phone, for instance, uh, in the bathroom, and you're moving away from your phone, it is immediately going to sound an alarm. And then when the alarm sounds, you are going to be uh, alert about the fact that you're moving away from your phone and you're going to you know, get back and get your phone immediately. Take care, my friend.